good morning. It's such a gloomy morning. It's like a fall feeling morning, which if you know, I ain't ready for. If you're new here, my name is Jackie, and I love to do hauls, hauls, hauls. Makeup tutorials, some fashion inspo, a little home decor. I keep saying that, but I haven't done it in a while. But, I don't know why. I am not ready for fall. But, I've been watching a few people here on YouTube that have been doing like their switch and picking up a couple of pieces and stuff. And I was like, Ooh, like one girl, she went to H&M, picked up a couple of blazers. I guess they were on clearance. And she was like, I'm just going to wear a nice little silk blouse and put up my sleeves. And it's going to be a look. And I was like, oh, yes. Because I love blazers. But I was like, no, I don't want to. No, I don't want to. And let me tell you, I was this close to popping open one of those bins and just going through it. Because the other thing is that I know when I take out my fall clothing and open up, I have them in bins, you know, per season. I'ma see a lot of stuff that, <laughs> I feel like I'm saying this to justify what, what comes next. I'ma see a lot of sweaters and a lot of tops that, you know, they got a little bolita, they got this, you know, oh, I don't like that. Look at these bolitas. They look old. They look... You know what I mean? And then... I'm going to put it in the Goodwill box. And then I'm going to be like, you know what? I need some new tops. I need some new sweaters. I need this. I, Girl, you don't. You don't need none of that. But... I know. Because I feel like every year I pack up my clothes. Like I wash it. I fold it. Put it in the bins. And then the next year I'm like... Oh, this looks old this looks this this looks that and I don't understand why because it didn't look like that when I put it in the bin but um yesterday uh, we were in the city we had went to Fordham Road and they had a lot of hoodies and stuff and I was like yes yeah but I'm in denial because today is Monday Friday is already September, so it's about that time. And it's getting darker early, which makes me sad. I get up in the morning and it's dark. Like, it's, uh, you know that feeling of fall? Yes, that's what I'm feeling. Last night when we came, when we got home, my husband was driving with the windows down because it was nice. And then it got cold. And I was like, oh, God. But... So I've been seeing a lot of people haul in their fall stuff, you know, stuff they picked up from Zara, stuff from H&M, you know, TJ Maxx, Marshall, all that stuff. And I can envision the look. So I'm like, oh, yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I think I got something like that. But I don't want to. I don't want to. Not yet. No, not yet. If you see me today, girl, I look like a pink marshmallow. Like florals and my pants is pink. Like... I'm in denial but I think September 1st which is Friday or maybe the following week I'm gonna start I'm gonna start pulling some stuff out because you know this week's supposed to be in the 80s so it ain't fall y'all but I gotta put some stuff away like I'm gonna put my bathing suits away because I know I ain't going to the beach I ain't going in my pool because I don't feel like it. But stuff like that I could put away. Like my bathing suits, cover-ups, you know, things like that I could put, put away. But I don't know. That means I got to do so much laundry because the other thing is you wash the clothes, you pack it up, then you take it out and it has like that stored kind of smell and i put in um dowdy sheets before i close it just to keep it but i don't know i don't know if it's the fact that you know you cook and the smell is there you grill and the smell stays you know 
so I need to wash it all which is gonna be like ugh. but I know a lot of you have already picked up some full you know clothes I know a lot of people are they're doing their back to school shopping because this week was tax free week and the mall was crazy but I just don't want to I don't want to not yet and I don't even know what I want for fall like last year I felt like I did a whole bunch of jogger sets this year I feel like I want to you know I, I kept saying you know on the weekends I'm at my dad's I want to be comfortable but I still feel like not that I want to dress up but I don't want to be in joggers every weekend you know like I feel like when you go like I feel girl spit it out I feel like when you get comfortable in your jogger sets and stuff you don't want to do nothing else but that and that is more of the feeling of being in my house in my pajamas you know a lot of the time I know now when it gets colder my dad for sure for sure ain't gonna want to go out not even for a walk you know so the other thing is the steam in the city be Mira, nena, que falta respeto. The steam in the city be on blast. Like you sweating like you in a sauna in the winter. Which is bad because then I go down for something and it's cold and I'm hot. And then I come to the heat from being... It's bad. That's how you get sick. But I want to do a little bit more. I want to do more of not dressy but a little bit more put together than joggers every weekend you know and I know I picked up a bunch of joggers because when I put them away it took like three bins to put them things away because I bought the hoodies with the sweat you know the set set but I think I want to do like like I said some leather liquid leggings we still leggings you know they're still comfortable and a nice blouse and a blazer my hat you know for someone who ain't ready you sure have a lot to say about it but next week i'll be ready next week i'll be ready because i'm feeling the itch you know and i try to avoid it i try to suppress it but i'm feeling the itch so i think next weekend when i get back from the city I'm gonna go through my bin and see, you know, what I got, what I wanna get rid of, what I don't want no more, kind of thing. Cause there's a lot of stuff that I had gotten last year and it didn't quite look the way I envisioned. It wasn't that image that I had in my head. When I put it on, I was like, girl, what the hell? But again, that's why I do a lot of like she and hauls and stuff because it's not going to hurt my soul when I have to get rid of it as much as if I went to Zara and spent like $80 on a top and then next year I'm like I don't want it yo you spent 80 bucks no no I will fling it right in the box because I know I didn't put spend too much on it or whatever you know so yeah yes I'm not doing no for the court yet, for sure, for sure. But I want to start getting out a couple of, maybe like a couple of my long sleeve cardigans because I got this short one on and the AC in the job, I don't know what is going on, but I'll be freezing myself. And in my house, it's nice and toasty. I have an iced coffee that I bring with me, but in the job, I'm gonna be wishing for a hot one, you know? So I think I'm gonna pull out a couple of my cardigans and then I do wanna see what's in store because I don't really, I don't really follow fashion. Like if something is in style, I'm not like, oh, I want that. You gotta speak to me. You gotta be like, I gotta walk into the store and you gotta be like, Jack, Jack, in order for me to buy you. There are certain things that I'll see, like in Pinterest or people when they're doing their lookbooks and stuff that I'm like, ooh, I like that, you know? 
that when I walk into a store, you're going to speak to me. But if I already seen you with it, then I know I'll keep an eye out for it. But it's not something where this is in style. I need to have it. No, you need to speak to me. You need to call me nicely. Meet up. Something like that. Because that's just how it is. And I want to try to incorporate color in the fall not just the spunk and spice latte colors you know the brown the orange the beige no the blacks i want to do i want to do like you know hunter green but also like a bright orange you know because I don't want to be wearing dull colors and then looking out the window at bare trees you know I want to bring some sunshine into my life so I'm gonna be doing that and the other thing is I move my beauty room around so that I can do more stand-up try-ons kind of things that first um, day of trying to trying to stand your that i was already tired but i want to be able to like show i got the um you remember i was telling you guys the this i'm gonna put that image of the camera stand that timu had that moves with you because it's censored so if i move out of frame and i'm like you know whatever it's like zip, zip. you know i was playing with it yesterday it took me a while to get the little remote like if you want to take a picture with it that little you know to link with my phone it, i would just i couldn't get it to do it and finally i did so as i was talking whatever you know sometimes i'm like i want to do like a screenshot um thumbnail of like me laughing during something you know that you're gonna be like oh this is gonna be a good time you know something like that so I was playing with it i like it i like it i like that it moves i just hope it's not like like you're gonna hear it kind of thing you know but it's moving so it's keeping you in frame because a lot of my videos i kept cutting off my head so i'm hoping this will adjust itself and try to you know um work for me so yeah yes um it's monday i'm already at work i don't know what this vlog is gonna be about but so far, I feel the itch for fall fashion, but slowly, Jack, slowly, slowly. I don't know. We're going to see how this goes. So, yes. Girl, you look so red. I look so red. Maybe it's the pink bouncing off my face. I don't know. But we'll talk in a minute. Okay. So, I'm using that new stand. As you can see it's moving with me and it didn't cut my head off so i started to clear out some of the jewelry and i don't know what happened but it stopped filming so i'm gonna add just a couple of more clips of the stuff but I'm, these are the necklaces and i'm gonna throw in the other jewelry for you to see but as you can see it's moving so this is this that i got from timu so i'm hoping that this is going to help me because as i move and i'm showing stuff you know the camera is going to move too because it's censored and then it's got this so that i can stop the recording or start once i get into it if i take it out of the video and i put it on camera i can do a pose and so yes i'm enjoying that i just don't know if it filmed if i hit the film record button when i was doing um, showing you the pieces that I'm going to get rid of. But as you can see, I got a few. But this is something that's very overwhelming for me because I have so much jewelry. And I'm always like, oh, I can use it here. I can use it. Girl, you're not going to use it. So stop it. So I'm putting it in the box. It's going to go to Goodwill. Someone else can enjoy it. And then I can get new pieces. So 
don't mind the mess so i've got these bracelets which i have to go through and then i have these that just came in but under here i have more earrings like another jewelry holder i've got these but then underneath i have like watches um more necklaces this is a, a dyson dryer which i want to review girl don't get more ghetto than this so i got this rocher and i put some of the jewelry in it because i wanted to put it in a drawer without the tapa like i wanted to put it in like that without this lid but it didn't come out exactly how i wanted but i have to go through these studs okay? and then i have to go through that and then i have more here so so the whole thing is filled right but the reality is i'm probably gonna be like after i put everything in this box that i'm gonna get rid of i'm probably just gonna be like you know what i i'm gonna keep it i'm gonna keep it i really need it. i really need it because it's very difficult for me to get rid of stuff so yeah it is um i don't know if i'm gonna leave it like that because i don't know if i like this here i just want to be able to have something displayed so as i'm getting ready in the morning i can go through it look around i had it okay so these look like this and i hope you've been filming because i've been grabbing some necklaces now these are gonna stay this one here is gonna go like this one here i got a feeling it didn't record so I'm just gonna put into the box the ones that are not gonna stay. Um, here. So I have this chain, and I actually put two together because these are um, angle bracelets. So I like to see them long like that, so I know not to put it with my bracelet bracelets. So let's put it there. And then I have this one, which is just like a necklace. But this part here is very short. Like whose head does that fit under? So I need to get like an extender, something like that, so that it can like hang, you know, that I could wear. Because it still looks nice. It still has shine and everything. It's just you trying to choke me. So yeah, that's the only thing. So we'll keep you. And then... If I turn it around, so like this side has more like florals. This I'll keep. Let me see if I can turn it this way. And then I've got these hair bands, but this part here hurts me back here. So I mean, they look pretty, like if I were to put put it on, but this is not comfortable. I think I'm gonna get rid of these. And then I'm going to save this. Then I have this one. Looks like that. Which I'm going to keep. And then I have this one. Which I wear a lot. This one is heavy. Looks like this. And I do wear this, you know, in the winter a lot. Because I like the bling. So we won't keep you. And then I have this one. Which I'm going to keep. I feel like these just dress up an outfit. Um... So for now, that's going to stay. Let me put you over there. I'm going to put you there. So I'll have a few pieces that I can like mix up when, um, when I'm looking for something. And then I have this bag and I still have these drawers. We're going to give that a break because, like I said, it's very overwhelming. So I'm going to show you the rest of the stuff that I got. So, another little jewelry box. And this one is like a nameplate. And it says Jackie Rods 105. So, I wore my necklace the other day. And so many people were, you know, telling me how they like the nameplate and whatever. What does it say? So, I was saying Jackie Rods 105. And they were like, what is that? So, I started telling people, it's my YouTube channel, my Instagram, you know. So, a lot of people at my job, 
don't know that I do YouTube, you know, because I work in the bank. But when I wore the necklace, I had so many people I went to Dunkin' and they were asking me. So I was like, I'm going to get a few. And instead of being like, here's my card, because I kind of feel awkward. I have business cards that say Jackie Rods 105, but I feel a little awkward sometimes. So if they see it and they're like, oh, what does that mean? Then I can just be like, it's whatever. So I got them. And I feel like I got a little bit crazy with it because when I realized that Timu customizes, I was like, hmm. Then I got this. And I saw this and I thought this was a good idea because sometimes when I'm out filming. Hi, Mita. Sometimes when I'm out filming and I have the phone, I feel like, I don't know, like it's kind of hard to like grip. So I thought I can. What the hell is this? So it's a, you attach your phone to it and then you can hold it like that. So let's say I, instead of holding the phone like this and trying to, you know, I can just hold it like this, like it's a camera. And then it's got this button here. So it's kind of like a camera. So as you're filming, you know, you can just turn it on. You can take your picture. It's got some button. It's got a charger. And then it's got this little thing that you attach to the back of your phone, kind of like a uh, sensor magnet kind of thing. I got to read the instructions. It's got the manual here. And take a picture button, switch it on. There's a light. Um, so it's got a light. And then it's a magnet it ch and you charge it. So it's kind of like this stand that I have that's censored. But with this, um, if I'm out filming and I want to just do a quick picture of, you know, the TJ Maxx or a picture of something. Because, you know, sometimes they don't let you film. But I thought this was a good idea. I got to figure out how it goes attached and all that. Um, but I want to do, you know, I'm, I was watching Nezzy just now. She uploaded her video. She was talking about Vlogmas. Sometimes when you're doing everyday filming, you don't always remember to charge batteries. You don't always remember to, you know have everything together for the next day so a lot of it will be on the phone where if i'm doing a dunkin run or something i can attach it do whatever film hold it and not you know when you hold your phone kind of like this it becomes uncomfortable anyways that's what i picked that up for and we're gonna see how that works so i saw this shirt and i had to have it because the saying is true so it's like a sleeveless top and it says today's mood is sponsored by tito's you know and a lot of my good mood is sponsored by tito no but i just thought it was nice it's a nice gray charcoal color the material is super soft super nice um i got it in a double x but this kind of looks like oh maybe it does so i figured i can wear this with some jeans and you know casual joggers whatever going in the fall and then a sweater on top if i want but just the saying is nice and the material is super nice super nice so yeah yes, that's how it is and it's stretched it's so soft so this is gonna be nice so yeah yes. i got in and as i'm getting rid of jewelry i end up picking up more so yeah um let's see I picked up a ring and it's funny because it says in little little letters i don't know if you can see it right up there it says jackie rads 105 so it's just like a nice three band ring if you want to put it on your thumb you can put it on your thumb i gotta get my nails done because they're looking crazy but i feel like once i get them done they're gonna look like so yeah i got that and then I got, <clears throat> I'm telling you, I went a little crazy. I don't know what I was thinking, but I picked up this little like bangle and it's got the other bolita on here. I hope it didn't come off, but it says again, Jackie Rods 105. So I got that. And then I got another chain that says Jackie Rods 105. So Hopefully that'll help me grow, you know, promoting myself. And then another bar, the same one in the gold. And then I got this one, which is like a, uh, to like a nameplate, but it hangs down and it says 
Virgo because I am a Virgo. Virgo in the house. Why is it my mom's? Where is it going to say? Virgo's in the house. So I know there's a lot of Virgos out there. This I'll be wearing in September because, you know. And then I got this one, which just has like a J on it. And then again, Jackie Rods 105. So I picked up those. I don't think I. Let me stop lying. Let me stop lying. Stop lying, Jack. Stop lying. Then I got this one. What is this? I should have taken them all out, but this is like vlog style. This is not really like a whole haul. And because a lot of it is the same, you know. So this is another one. And it's like a double. And it just says the same thing, Jackie Ryan's 105. Um, so hopefully during Vlogmas, as I'm vlogging out, I can wear some of it. And if people are asking, you know, sometimes they're asking, what are you filming? What are you filming? Is that for TikTok? Is that? You know, I can say, no, it's for YouTube. And then just be like, Jackie Ryan's 105. <laughs> so that's so far everything. This is what I was really excited about was this camera stand and the fact that it moves. Um, right now I turned it off, but... I'm gonna test it out. I'm gonna test it out. I see it moving. It keeps me in frame. So we're gonna see. We're gonna see. Now, the lighting is a little off because normally I film this way. So my lighting comes this way, you know? Um, and then I have my vanity over here. So it's the lighting is like tilted a little, I feel. So yeah, yes. So far, that is everything. Look at my earrings. Look how pretty, pretty. I'm gonna do kind of like a simple get ready with me like a neutral natural kind of look because it was re it, it was requested um so i'm gonna be doing that probably tomorrow morning i don't know if i'm gonna add it to this so i'm gonna do it separate but yeah so let's go because i gotta go to work i just wanted to show you a couple of pieces that i'm getting rid of and then behind the scenes i might be like no jack keep it keep it keep it but for now that's what i'm getting rid of so yeah yes let's go ah! <sighs> All right, so as you saw, I cleared out a couple of things. And that is very, like I said, overwhelming. Because like with everything else, I'm always like, I could use, if I don't like a shirt or a pants or something, I'm like, ah, I could use it as pajamas. Girl, you ain't using it as pajamas. It'll sit in the gaveta for months, 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 years, and you ain't gonna wear it. So with the jewelry, I love to see it and even though some of the items I'm kind of over like I don't know I just I want something else or I don't need to dress up so much for work before I used to have to dress up a lot then they went into like this business casual and I was always like what the hell does that mean business casual like I know for guys it's like khakis and you know a nice shirt instead of wearing like the blazers and stuff but for women i always feel like what does that mean so i don't have to dress up as much as i used to um i don't have to wear a suit i don't need a blazer even though i want to wear the blazer like i like the style of it and stuff but i don't need to be so dressed up and a lot of those big statement necklaces i feel like i needed because a lot of my blouses were solids and when we went into this business casual, I felt like the blouse has all this color, but it's still a blouse. So in my mind, that meant business casual, you know? So some of those necklaces, I don't really need. And I haven't worn in a while. The bracelets I haven't worn in a while. Some of the earrings that were just like studs and stuff. Because they used to have this rule where your earring couldn't be more than an inch. And when we went into the business casual, it was like whatever. Um, you know, they didn't want cotton. Now it's like whatever, you know. So I feel like I toned down a lot of my dressing. <laughs> Even though I'm pretty sure you guys are like, what, girl, stop. But I don't need a lot of it. But it's very difficult for me to get rid of it. And it might be selfish of me, but i rather give stuff to someone I don't know. Because when I give stuff to, like, my sister or friends, and then I see them with it, I'm like, I should have kept it. And that's just selfish but 
it'll be easier to give it to Goodwill instead of giving it to my sister and then she's wearing it and I'm like, give it back to me, give it back to me, give it back to me. You know what I mean? So <laughs> that sounded bad. But, you know, I enjoy giving stuff to people. I just don't want to see you wear it. <laughs> I just don't want to see you wear it. But, no. All jokes aside, it's very difficult to get rid of stuff. So, I have that all in a box. And the reality is that I might go through the box six or seven times before it goes to Goodwill. And start pulling stuff out. But, I just wanted you to see that, you know, styles change. And when you buy stuff from like... Timu and Shein and you don't pay a lot, it's easy to say I don't want that, then to go to a jewelry shop and be like, I'm going to spend 800 bucks on this gold chain and then be like, I don't know where this anymore, I don't, I don't want that you know what I mean? so, yeah it is um, I am going to end this vlog here because I feel like this was kind of long and when I go to edit, I'm going to be like, I because then when I go to upload, it's taking two years to upload. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this kind of, you know, car vlog. Let's clear out some jewelry, make room for the new, which I will also do going into fall, y'all, because... They are when I start pulling stuff out the bins, I already know that I'm not gonna want to keep a lot of it. So yeah, it's what's this girl doing here? She on vacation. Anyways, so yeah, let me know if you like these videos. If you want to see me do my clear out, make room for video, and then yeah, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes because this is very difficult. This is testing the testing my you know anxiety and whatnot so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you're new here and you made it this far girl hit that subscribe button everybody else i will see you in the next one bye